Some people believe that the world is not fair. It does not treat every person in a fair and just manner. However, there are some people who believe that world is not biased. It does not pick and choose. It treats everybody in the similar way. So what is the truth? Whether the world is fair or whether the world is not fair. So let us try to examine whether the world is fair or unfair. Now let us imagine a case of a beautiful girl. A girl who is extremely beautiful and she is born in a very decent family. Now when she grows, everybody try to court her. Everybody is nice to her. Everybody treats her well. When she become a young woman, she gets many marriage proposals and she can basically choose any person whom she want to marry. Now, according to her, the world is quite fair and generous because she has been treated very well by the world. But now let us imagine the case of another girl who is not at all beautiful but rather ugly. Now, the same world does not treat this girl properly. Nobody wants to make friendship with her. She grows and she doesn't get marriage proposal. Her parents find it difficult to get a proper match for her. When this girl sees the world, she does not find the world fair. Because ultimately, this girl has no role to choose her looks, to choose her parentage, to choose economic background. She has no role to play. And still the world does not treat her fairly. The same thing can be said about the guys also, men also. Some people are born more intelligent and they can achieve success easily. They get more marks in the examination because they have the right aptitude. While some other people work even harder but still they fail to achieve the results. Now, the world does not treat everybody in the same way. We on one side is the recipient of the world's treatment. On the other side, we are also part of the world who give this treatment. So even a person who is not so good looking, not so wealthy, he also desire a girl who is very beautiful, good looking. In the same way, a girl who is not so beautiful will also desire a person, a man who is quite good looking, successful. So the world treats the people differently. Let us accept it. Just because we have been treated fairly, just because the world has been nice to us, it does not mean that the world is nice to every person. And so people have the right to complain that the world is not fair to them. And it is a fact that the world is not fair to everybody. But what is the solution? The solution lies in understanding that the world has some criteria to like or dislike the people. It treats some people in a better way as compared to others. So let us understand one thing. Nature has not given everything to every person. It has given something to one person and it has given something else to another person. So we too have some qualities in us. The point is to understand and appreciate those qualities and develop and nurture those qualities. When we develop and nurture the qualities which are given to us by the nature, then the same world will appreciate us. Now Abraham Lincoln was not a very good looking person. He was rather considered to be one of the ugliest person of his times. And still, he rose to become the president of United States of America and today he is considered to be one of the finest president that America ever had. In the same way, there are many leaders, there are many researchers, there are many scientists, there are many actors who are not very good looking or who are not having any special skills, but still whatever they had, they develop those skills and achieve success in this world. So instead of complaining about the unfairness of the world, let us focus on ourselves and nurture our skills so that we can achieve success and happiness in this same world.